G'day. Uh, welcome to the South Perth Review Show. I'm here with Sanzi. Um, How are you, mate? How are you, mate? Yeah, very good, Thank thanks. You. That's good. Um, we're going to run through the yeah. uh, results from the WAC competition, some scores from Subturf as well. We do apologise if we're distracted slightly. We do have a, a bit of a crowd here in that pest, so we do apologise. We have a live studio audience, which is makes it a bit of a challenge. Um, we're going to run through the scores from the WAC comp and from the Subturf. Um, we're going to start with the WAC comp. Why not? Yeah. Let's start Yeah, let's there. start with the WAC comp. Uh, oh, sorry. And just a reminder, we have Grosey Cam today. Yes, which you do have Grosey. Thankfully, means I don't have to look in that direction, which is tricky. Um, we're going to start with our fourth grade, who were playing at Scarborough, and uh, they had a fantastic day, a brilliant yeah. day. Um, they put on 335 with Mitchie Allen peeling off yeah. a fantastic 100, while supported by Atreya and Robin, 47 and 42 respectively, mm -hmm. which was yeah. a fantastic effort. Um, threes here at Richardson, yeah. um, bought up 293. Um, Lockie Heim, 87, opened the batting, did very well. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Bales, uh, 59. Bales, yes. Bales into the threes. Yes. Uh, Flinty, 56. And uh, Sammy is 53 not, which is a brilliant effort. Yes. Um, very sort of, uh, yeah, revealing. I'm glad for the Bales got some runs. Um, it's good to hear. Yeah. Fortune to twos. Had a bit of a tougher day up yep. at Scarborough. So I bowled out for 120. Uh, Mulder, 30. And Nate Keogh, 25, which is uh, a good effort. Um, in reply, Scarborough have gone past six down for 131. Uh, so this is just what's happening. Um. Razor, Razor, <laughs> no. No, we're just going to pretend what's happening in the background yeah. isn't happening. Razor, four for 38. Yeah. And uh, unfortunately, they've gone past score, but I'm sure that's set yeah. up for an exciting second day this weekend. Uh, the A grade, <laughs> sponsored by, uh, thanks to our sponsor, Southside Mitsubishi, uh, Peterson's Garden and, Ma and Maintenance, mm -hmm. and Metro Hotel, of course. Yep. Um, the A grade had a tough day. It's it's not funny, but they had Almost a tough day. Almost as tough as we're doing here. It's yeah. Uh, so Scarborough yeah. racking up five for three hundred and sixty-six. So a tough yeah. day. Um, Bevs, Darius, uh, Eric Bowie, so Brando picking up wickets. Yeah. Um, but a big chase for the boys this Saturday, and uh, hopefully send Brownie off in some style with his yes. final A grade game. So yeah. we wish Brownie all the best heading into this Saturday. Definitely deserves it. Some runs and a win to finish him up. Absolutely. Uh, how true. about the Turf Boys? How did, yes. uh, how did you guys go this week? Um, sorry, staying with our one day threes, they um, had a good win. Um, again, so just get the stats up against uh, Kurt and Vic Park. Uh, we made 175 with um, quite a few blokes chipping in with Mickey Adams, 37, and Roger uh, Riachi. I hope I got that right, Rog. Uh, game 36, and then they bowled... Do you want to get the wrong Roger? Yes, they bowled Curtin Big Park, so 175 they scored, right, and then bowled Curtin Big Park out for 124. Good um, day. The noticeable wicket was Bryce Pickerskill with uh, 4 for 31. So, well done there to Bryce. Uh, on uh, sixth grade, um, tough day at the office again for the boys, so... Um, we chased chasing 229, and unfortunately the boys only made 145, but we do... Uh, Just came up short, unfortunately. Yes, we did have one, uh, Carl Stockley, get 74 not out. Um, Stockers is here. Uh, 74 not out, 129. Wow. Um, for those, anyone that's seen um, Stockers bat, um, they'll be as shocked as I am. It's a miracle. But oh, that's three, pretty three harsh, bombs, isn't it? Three bombs. Three, three bombs, well done, mate. Um, four fours. Four fours? Good. Now nah, he actually, from what I heard, he batted very well. Um, off to our fourth grade um, side, uh, our second side was um, actually really done. Pretty well done by the boys who yeah. um, were chasing a hundred and I'll just get this right, chasing hundred and seventy-seven, and we got a, a eight down, um, which is really good by the boys. Um, some of the notable ones there is Tom Bird, forty-eight. Ayush, uh, 47, um, which is really good. Fantastic. Uh, Al Pryor, 26. But then um, one of these uns unsung ones, I like to say, is um, Kane Palmer. I only got 12, but I've 62 balls opening up um, to just take that shine off, which um, then makes it easier for the blokes out there, which is Absolutely. really good. Uh, top side was probably one we, uh, one we definitely want to forget. Um, <laughs> tough day. Do you give him a bit of a spray afterwards, Sansi? Or? Uh, yeah, it was tough. To, to our credit, the boys, you know, we're defending 141. We got a couple of early. We think we had them 5 for 50 or 4 for 40 or something. Mm. We thought we might be a chance. Um, 
but then the track flattened out and um, Ocean Winds ended up 5 for 364 but we did have uh, three three of our four pace bowlers um, or five pace bowlers were injured at one stage so um, we did even have to relent to the old uh, swap gloves and I had to keep and CB bowled but CB did get a wicket didn't you CB? Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did get a wicket, which um, I'm unfortunate now because he's one of the pests behind the camera. So um, I do regret that. But uh, on to the juniors, mate. How'd they go? The juniors, uh, yeah, it's a bit of a tough day for our, um, for our juniors. Um, for some of our teams, our 17s chasing 170. Uh, sorry, depending on 70 this week. Uh, 15s will be chasing 145 up at uh, Scarborough. 14s, um, unfortunately, went down in their prelim final uh, to June Lup, a very good June Lup side. But good news is our 13s got through to the grand final, so we wish Brandon uh, Gaffs and his team all the best in the uh, 113s uh, in their final. <laughs> wish I hadn't done that now. Um, Wish them all the best in their final <laughs> in uh, a couple of weeks' time here against yeah. uh, uh, Subi, I think. Yeah. Subi, yeah. We'll see. So, wish them all the best for that. Yep. Um, nothing yet for the girls. There's no teams named for the girls this weekend. No, there's not. Um, well, I will do a review of the um, girls last week, though. So, we'll get that up now. Um, just very quickly, whilst that sounds like you get some numbers up, uh, just a big shout out as well for our. Uh, wind up on February the sorry uh, April the twelfth uh, Friday night at Metro Hotel, which is one of, our, one of our great sponsors. So can't wait to come down to you guys there. Yes, so no, of course needed for that. Uh, so the A grade side last game against um, Midland. Uh, Midland got uh, nine for two hundred and forty nine. <laughs> Thank you, Snowy. He's just uh, just made one of the people behind be quiet, which is very good. Um, uh, yeah, Midland got uh, 9 for 249. Um, Mil- uh, sorry, Zoe, the standouts there. I'm <laughs> sorry, it's a bit happening behind us. The standouts there is uh, Zoe Brickliffe got uh, 3 for 36 off her 10 overs. Um, so it's a big task by the girls. Unfortunately, they got bowled out for 123. Stay with it, Sandy. We're nearly at the end. We're nearly at 123. Um, <laughs> The, uh, the standout for the batting, and there wasn't too many in 123, but um, like uh, like usual, uh, Molly Healy did get some runs. She got 40 uh, of 59 balls. And <laughs> and, um, TK, I wish we hadn't started the clock. TK, how there. many did Emma score? TK. <laughs> TK, how many did Emma score? <laughs> I think we just say 18? Yeah, 18. Yeah. <laughs> She's got <scored eight. laughs> Alright, um, and we'll go to uh, the B grade side. Um, B grade side. Uh, Melville got 3 for 241. Um, in reply, so standouts in the bowling there. Um, Standouts in the bowling, obviously too wasn't bad. too many. We only got three wickets, so we go to the batting, um, and we only got nine for 109. Yeah. Standouts with the bat, uh, we had... Phoebe North. Phoebe North got 24, 25, so start off. And um, Anjali McGrath got um, 25, or 25 as well. Right so no um, teams named for the women's teams this week, but they are playing, uh, the A grade are playing Subi Florit at uh, Richo, and the B grade are playing Subi Florit at Richo too. So awesome. both here, um, I don't think there's anything more to be added. We've got through it again, apologise for anything yes. that might have happened today. Uh, it's been a bit, um, a bit few distractions, but yeah. we got through it. We did what we have to do. Yeah. Sandy, it's been a pleasure. Yes. Stay good luck to Brownie as well. And oh, good luck to Brownie on the weekends. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna see you next week. <laughs> <laughs> Not. <laughs> no. Who the.